Hey, my G. How do you get into something like this? So, like, if we need, so you still need your CDLs for this? Yeah, it's got air brakes. Air brakes, okay, okay. So, like, a particular construction company, like, you just go to Indeed or something like that? I'm not sure about that. I mean, I, I work with uh, family, but, I mean, he's got a couple cranes and there's only one operator, so. So, would you have to know, now, driving it, Driving it, of course, you need your CDL, but to operate the crane, do you need another type of... Uh, on, it depends on who you go to do work for. Some places require you to have a license, some don't. All right, but do you still have to have a license to operate the crane? Yeah, it's a different license. It's, a, it's called an NCCCO license. It's just for operating cranes, but just for this type of crane. You get a different certification for each type of crane. Where would you, where would a person go to get that type of certification from? Texas and Lubbock. Oh, okay. Lubbock or Houston. Okay. All right. How long you been, how long you been rocking out with the company? Eight years. Eight years? Is this year round or just certain yeah, points? Here is year round. Is it because, okay, okay, okay. Do you guys go out of state or no? Appreciate your time, bro. Thank you. Take your man step, but I love your profile. Uh -huh. Whisper in your ear and get uh -huh. you all shook up, but don't blush. Don't blush. Just keep this on the hush.